trademark Mandela Tech 2000. In this video, I watched the Mandela Catalog Volume 4. Friend of the channel, Alex Kister, came out swinging the other day with another banger. Look down that hallway, Sarah. There's a firearm at the end. You're gonna get your mind blown, literally. Oh, Death Grips album. We stream this live on twitch.tv slash quite where I actually watched volumes two and three before we watched four as a refresher. I'll be there live tonight doing some more stuff like this if you want to join. If you enjoy this video, there will be this big card at the end that takes you to the time we reacted to the Walton Files. That's another very good one. Did you know less than 20% of y'all are subscribed with notifications on? If you subscribe and hit that bell icon, you'll never miss an upload. And you can always undo it later if you decide you hate me. We are react andying it up tonight, fellas. Alex said Mandela Catalog 2 and then 333. Three. I haven't seen this one in a very long time. I'm gonna tell you that it didn't work in that context. Hello? Uh, may I schedule an appointment? Me when I talk to the dentist. I still hear the meows of my old cat Johnny, but the little guy passed away a few years ago. Listen, every person with a dead pet has that exact same experience. I'm just saying you're not special. You might want to get over it. I don't think it's an alternate. I just think his soul roams the house still. You think you could help guide him? We try, man. Well, we could do tonight if you want. Can you do three nights? Oh, I'm just saying. What if it was five? <laughs> How much is it gonna cost to make it two more? You know, a marketable title. How about 500 a night? Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh, that's getting paid better than any fucking watch guard at Freddy Fazbear. Yeah, kitty, kitty. Everything okay? Your piece here? You look so stupid right now. What am I supposed to do for a literal ghost cat? Okay. It's kind of weird. I'm not gonna bust down this random lady's door. Oh, come on. She's paying you to stay at, stay at the house. You might as well go all in. I really don't like this now. I'm the opposite. This is kind of interesting. Deeper than a cat here. I think that's the problem. I realize what this could do for us. Do what for us? We're already on the run. We don't need this attention again. Do you like it or not? I'm going back in. Hey, look, a missing poster. <laughs> Dude, that's not funny. Yes, this is where I hit the hay. There's no hay in this image. You're an idiot, Adam. This is why you got kidnapped, because you thought you were gonna hit the hay when there's not even a fucking, like, little thing of straw in there. This is giving FNAF 4 vibes. Personally, it reminds me of the Mandela Catalog Volume 2. They're open. I'm literally looking straight at you. Now, believe it or not, they actually sampled that in the new Ice Spice song. It's the same Mandela jump scare type beat. I spices the modern queen Princess Diana. There is no one like her. Anyways. Dude, I don't know what you want from me. I'm as serious now as I've ever been. I get that I screw around sometimes, okay? But that's just what I do. Whoa. Devastated that I'm not as broken as you still are with everything that's happened. And I'm sorry that I can't keep helping you carry this burden. And I'm sorry that these are the lives that we lead today. But Adam, if you walked down those stairs, you'd be joining her. Hey look, it's a cat! It's a stock photo of a cat! Pretty good! Little button nose, little munchkin idiot. That's not a cat. That's not even close to a cat. Can I unleash my fucking most consistent hot take to this day? Still right here? Looks like fucking nice- It looks like fucking looks like Epic Lloyd. It's the same. It's him. It's him, but like scrawny. Lately, okay, just like look at him and squish his face a bit. It's Epic Lloyd from Epic Rap Battle to History. Wait, that's the wrong video. Dude, you're speeding. And you're not even playing French Montana in the background. What's the point? The Mandela Catalog Volume 2 by Alex Kister. Alright, we're gonna give this one a quick watch then. Fucking Volume 4, baby. Hello. No one is available to take your call. Good evening, officer. Uh, one of our students, Mark Heathcliff, uh, he's been absent for the past couple days without any reason, no phone calls from parents. We don't have any apparent emergency contacts on file for him. If you could have someone pay a visit to, um, uh, the three... Redacted. Redacted. ...up new and make sure everything's alright, it would be much I, appreciated. I, I can't explain it, but when I see something either physically redacted in a message, audio bleeped out in a, like, with silence in a series like this, I have to say redacted out loud. Oh, and if someone could try to get the contact info, much appreciated. Uh, thank you, and have a nice night. Turns out it's Freddie Gibbs. He lives at Mark Heathcl Heathcliff's old address. I need some backup here. What are you talking about? Where's the others? The officer that was already checking out the place just pussied out. Jesus. Hey, um, it's fucking up. Camera. Weaver. Oh, yeah, that was a body, by the way. Hello? Hello? Okay, that's a that's just like Identify yourself. immature, man. Identify yourself. Like, you don't fucking grow up. Look. <laughs> what do you want?
where Thatcher he was finding that well no he got out of there bro did a dolphin dive out the window i imagine what a flat ass security cam that is not capturing shit this is a 2d image whoever put fucking got these for the stations just got cardboard cutouts put them on the corners and was hoping nobody would notice even the walls of the building are made out of paper mache 1078 questing backup this is an unauthorized use of our colonel identify yourself Lieutenant Thatcher Davis, MCPD. 18, requesting assistance from... This quality is worse than a COD lobby. I feel like I'm about to get called a slur. It's like the more I hear these mics, somebody's gonna say some fucking out-of-pocket shit. Oh, here comes the highlight. Are any available units in this area? Shut up. Shut up. Stop or I'll shoot! I said stay back! Uh-oh, bad decision, Thatcher. Cyberpunk character creation. Ooh, damn! That last frame, that last frame where it, like the fucking picture of employee of the month just melts, gets me every time. There's not enough room for the two of us, Lieutenant. The, the silent outline footage is like a lot worse than the more detailed shot from about a minute ago. Super well made. Now, seems like poor Thatcher there died, you know, just got absolutely mauled. And while that may be true, a little unfortunate for him. We don't have to wait to see, find out his fate for too long. Also, this is the most fit, like, <laughs> like TikTok haircut I've seen on a Mandela catalog character yet. All right, let's see what what what's Alex Kister got for us. No subtitles. That's what. In the beginning, the Earth was created without form, as a spirit hovered over the face of the waters. The waters. And on the fourth day, God created the invert verdict. The flip vertical tool in Photoshop. I fucked up the delivery, sorry. The reflect tool in Adobe After Effects, fuck below, you. The land would be called Earth. Hey, that, what's that? That tree was doing something funky. A grand array of stars and planets filled the emptiness of the night sky. That's a fucking fruity pebble, dude. On the sixth day, a man was created from the dust of the ground, followed by a woman to keep him company. I'm definitely in Sunday school as a toddler again. I have learned all this shit already, man. I passed this, I passed this question on the SAT. You don't need to tell me the Bible story again. Ooh, we gotta love that compositing. Isn't that the false, the false prophet, like the false shepherd? He thinks he's slick hiding his head behind the tree, but no, I recognize those robes. Apple. <laughs> Sorry guys, if you wanted, if you wanted me to not ruin this premiere, I'm gonna do my best, but you picked the wrong person to watch this with. This night was different than the last. Woman would gaze up at the sky. Brilliance and beauty of the stars were obscured by the man. Staring down at her. Hey Dave, it's O'Brien. How's it going, man? It's been a while. No, you know. Same old, same old. He sounds like Eminem doing a country accent. I don't know. Uh, you know how it is. I'm sure you've seen the news. <laughs> Okay, this is definitely on purpose. The scuffness of this green screen here is really funny. Hey, the merch is real though. If I can't buy that, that's a missed marketing opportunity. Dave, same old procedure. Drop off when you're done, Thatcher. That shot's cool. It popped out and called me a forehead. Got insulted by a VHS player. That's so fucked. Property of Dave. Hands off! Can imagine him going back and forth and scribbling it real thick with permanent marker. Yeah, this is exactly what I was imagining it. Just going over it back and forth with the same lines to make it look very scribbled. Luke AFK. It looks like a friend of mine. Like someone I know. It's not him, but it sure looks similar. I'm Sarah Heathcliff, founder of the Paranormal Club at Bythorn High School. I look to do some private investigations and help some people out from the surrounding areas. I'm currently looking for a work partner to pursue this line of work with. I look forward to hearing back from someone. Sarah Heathcliff, currently at large. Okay, she's not missing. She's actively on the run. She did the hey, race, Sarah. like take it. I'd like to join you with your investigation stuff, since I think that sounds pretty cool. Oh, there's Murray. I go to Workshaw High School, but I hope that's not too much of an issue. Also... I grew up in Mandela. So I have some ideas of places that we can explore. Up to you, though. Hope to hear back from you. Adam Murray, currently at large. Also a murderer. Special announcement. Everyone, please welcome Adam. Hello, everybody. Me and my friend Adam are excited to announce that we have recently founded... The Bythorn Paranormal Society. <laughs> oh, bro, it's got that drop shadow. That's how you know this is the real deal. There is nothing that will scare us away. Just give us a call. Except perhaps a firearm. Please don't point one of those at us. This will be fine. I promise. Imagine the reactions from this. No way this place was abandoned, Adam. Shh. Okay. Ready to get your mind blown? Uh. Look down that hallway, Sarah. There's a firearm at the away. end. You're gonna get your mind blown, literally. Specifically said, don't point firearms at me. And the first thing you say is you're gonna blow my mind? What am I supposed to think? Hallway, Sarah. Look at it. And don't look away. Oh, there's no firearm. Now press play. What the fuck is this? Shh, shh, shh. Just 
watch. Oh, there's the fire up. Oh! Don't you want to see? I can't look! Please. It's literally looking at us, Sarah. Oh! Ah, stop it! Please! Oh, Death Grips album. Got a crazy good shot, Sarah. No, not doing that ever again. I just need time, all right? I'm gonna keep doing these with someone, but you need someone else. Evelyn, can we please talk this through, Sarah? Mm-hmm. You gotta try 25 milligrams next time, bro. Like, weed! Remove? Yeah, I don't do drugs, buddy. You're a bad influence. Also dead, so like, that too. Not bailing you out when the cops find you. They won't. They're all bark and no bite. Mm-hmm. This is so late 2000s where he made his profile picture black and white on purpose. So yeah, make those eyes pierce the camera even more than you were already trying to. And I'm pretty sure he's dead or something. Putting an or something after saying you're pretty sure somebody's dead is fucking crazy, man. Like, if it stopped that, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Like, it's it casual. Okay, wait, let me say the good news. He might have a body on her hands, but I did win the Powerball. Absolutely not. Call me now. Oh, man. I was a... Oh, what the fuck? The edge is spreading like a virus, man. Christ. Adam, eventually someone will stumble across that. You just drove off. Didn't really think it would be that big of a deal. <laughs> Clearly, from the or something. Yeah, I saw the body and everything. It was mangled. There was like fucking cuts and wounds I didn't recognize from every any living creature. Didn't really think about it too much. Put yourself in my shoes for a second. I just got done walking for miles in the cold, all right? Would you expect me not to take the car? What the hell has gotten into you? Got some killer footage, though. <laughs> Bro, he is such a YouTuber right now. Somebody like it literally like multiple vloggers are like, yeah, he almost died, but the shot was sick. He was your best friend. No, he wasn't my best friend. I was his best friend. Oh. I thought you were better than that. I didn't even get to hear the good news, man. I'm bummed. No one damn old. Mandela County population trend report, 1990 to 2009. And it's going down. Man, it must fucking suck there. In the bottom of my stomach eats away at me like a cancer. All drowned out with a humming of fluorescent lights. The NAF ambience. Their souls would find their final resting place in a sense. I threw to the flames in an act of self-preservation. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't want to get, talk over the monologue, but listen, I don't know why you guys are trying to paint this guy as emo. Like he definitely, like this series takes place in the right frame for that to be the case or like for him to be seen. But I feel like he probably has the best reason to be emo out of anybody in this currently watching this video. His entire town is being taken over by supernatural beings that are literally unexplainable. Like a reminder of what I did. Thanks for the sub, mommy. Fuck! God Same damn it. Time. God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it. Oh, brain. I, I said that out loud. That's on camera forever. Get ready for me morning routine video. Oh, he's going to bed. He is not getting up. It's not a life in the day, a day in the life of a small Twitch streamer. The day is over. Dude! <laughs> oh, it moved. That wasn't a still image. It moved. Oh, that's creepy. I don't want to look away because, like, you can barely see it in the artifact thing. Just gonna have to take my word for it. No, 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 no. I'm not firing you. You remember our last good day? Yeah, me either. Dave, please. Don't even have to pay me anything extra. This is all I have. I appreciate your loyalty so much, Evelyn. It's been a good run. Bye-bye. Dave, wait. What's with the closet? The old TV? Why do you stop? She watched the video on his TV, lol. It's about time that I take you up on your offer. That's an HD ass camera, man. I can see the force. Patrick Davis. Oh, Seems that effect's fucking cool. Wait, I want to see that again. Patrick Davis. Oh. Seems like I made a mistake. I can't tell if that's like a Cinema 4D Face Track 3D model when it looks fucking weird as fuck. Afraid of your own reflection, Lieutenant. Dead or alive, you're no use to these people. A man without a purpose in a world that doesn't need him. A scared boy with a gun. Hey, look, it's his real head this time. I sure hope this movie is Creative Commons. I guess this is more for my peace of mind. I miss you a lot, man. I like to think that. You're watching me, somehow, making fun of me while I write you this fucking letter. But I'm always greeted by that same invasive silence. I keep driving by the house like, uh, I'm gonna get over it somehow, you know? But it hasn't gotten easier. Cause the reality is, Ruth, I don't think <laughs> I'm gonna find- I thought that said, Sergeant, bro. I am so stupid. Now you're dead, cause I was too fucking scared. I was too fucking scared. You deserve better, Weaver. <laughs> You really did. The spoken word over this beat almost feels like it could have come off like a leftover from the most recent Quedeca album. Let me say the good news. You almost done with the video. Do you think he's actually making that shit? He is not making that shit. This dude loves the or somethings and the whatevers to life threatening situations. You forgot the tone indicator. Draft one, a celebration of life. 
Damn, he actually did make that shit. It sucks. <laughs> it's dog shit. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Dude, like, he fucking said. All right, guys, I'm about to break the immersion again, but this is like a bit that only me and Flinders will be able to appreciate. Okay, 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 okay. You know, it pulls it up. Is this video? <laughs> Rest in peace, Adam! Woo! Anyways, special announcement regarding Jonah. Oh, Jonah died, not Adam. Oops. With heavy hearts that we announce the passing of Jonah Marshall, recent member of the Bythorn Paranormal Society. He, he, this is a text-to-speech voice. Could not even get on the actual mic for the- Jonah passed away peacefully, surrounded by his level. Oh, hey, look, it's the face. That's what I look like on a good day. Special guest. Oh my god, I just got up until he On the phone, Evelyn Miller. Oh Christ. The investigations of Jonah. I never believed in that kind of stuff. He always came across as a skeptic, sort of just more surprised than anything. There was always something going on with him. I never said that. No, it's a waste of my word. I never said that. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I don't know why that caught me off guard. Please, get the fuck out of my ass! Grim. Fuck, that's unsettling. That's unsettling. Face Studio 2, Mandela Tech 2000. All this shit. Ugh. The manual for more detailed instructions. Trademark Mandela Tech 2000. How does an 1,000 person town have the leading tech for in the mid 2000s to do some special generation technology? Like, this is not some tech hub of the world, man. This is not Silicon Valley. T totally normal face right there. You can type in anything that you want your face of choice to say. Several faces can be saved on to Face Studio 2, creating magical fun for everyone. Better reality? I trust I trust that mascot telling me these things. Amazing society of followers of the truth. Oh, this is probably, aesthetically, this is one of the most unnerving visuals from this entire series so far. Man, that is fucking me up. It's so I, uncanny with the dangling feet as well. Oh, oh, that's so fucking cool, though, too. Disturbing as hell, but wow. A person's actually walking into the fake build? Okay, compositing, and this is good. Alex has gotten so fucking good at this, man. Hello? Mr. Davis, are you here? The editing is so goofy. I think that's like an aesthetic choice. And I think it works within the limitations of what a single person like Alex can realistically do while still upping the scope. Aesthetic choice. I think that's smart. Like it's black and white. The contrast is very stark. It's a mix of like 2D landscapes, weird 3D compositive or green screen compositive footage and like very, very basic 3D models. There's just something uncanny about it. Like total of its parts, you know? The false shepherd. Figure now, the stage was set for you. Yet you still managed to follow the shepherd. <laughs> I like that visual of the like the false shepherd in both eyes. Divorce agreement. Son Adam did not react to any audio or visual stimuli during the assessment. This may be a result of A, lack of basic intellectual capabilities compared to other children his age, B, the result of the recent phenomenon occurring with children his age. That strobing light effect with like dark, like the rolling dark that shows something new each time. Very so- I love that. That was so sick. Hello, we have been trying to contact Adam Murray. Is this you? Please confirm yes or no. Just say no like talking bit. Please confirm yes. Illusion of choice. <laughs> oh. It's fucking- It's Epic Lloyd! Do you remember that night, Murray? 
is such a cool fucking tie-in and like way they've looped it back around. Your skin is not your own. You're not the real you. What's going on, Adam? Who are you talking to? You need to call me back now. I don't know what's going on. Please don't make me have to worry about you. Please call me back. Please. I deceived him. The Mandela Prophet. We have their prayers and their records. It begins today. God fucking damn, he does that. He that's he he's done it again. This dude does not miss. Adam was an alternate all along. Yes. <laughs> what? Just feel that out. <laughs> uh, good lord, I need to leave like a like and comment because I'm I'm once again blown away. That's the best one. We've watched the two big ones before this. That's fucking good. If you watch this on YouTube, did you know you missed out on us looking at the premiere of this on Twitch.tv/slash Quite where I stream on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays? It could have been here. This shit's really good.